<laughs> All right, so my dumbass lost my freaking tow hook to the G. Because the G is so low, we had to remove the bumper here. Put the e-brake down. Good? Good. We're gonna be cutting it close. Yeah, Not 7.30, we have about an hour to get there. So we're good. I hope we get there just on time. I wanna see the shop and talk to the guys, see what they say. There we go. Okay, so now we're all good. We're gonna have to bring the bumper with us because it was too low, so we had to remove it. The fucking loyal stallion. And yeah, we'll let you know when we get to the shop what the next steps are gonna be. We're just gonna slowly make our way. We have like another 40 minute drive. I'm just gonna take the 407, because fuck it, bro. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna waste my time with this stupid shit. So I'm gonna take the 407, go to JDM Addiction. Hopefully I get there before they close. And, uh, uh, pick up what we need and then head home and do that oil change and fix whatever we can on the car and call it a day. Tomorrow I'm going to the mechanics. I'm going to be dropping off the G tonight at the mechanic shop and getting it um, looked over by a buddy of mine. Uh, they're just going to check the fluids, check the clutch, uh, the clutch pedal to make sure it's operating properly. Um, you know, just do a walk around <clears throat> and tell me what they think about it and We'll see what happens from there. I'm gonna turn this back on when we get to the shop. Peace! We're outside diner right now. And uh, I'm just waiting for the fucking, the tuner to kind of give us the go ahead to start, start the bitch up and tune this shit. I'm so nervous, honestly. So much time and effort and money, not to mention. So we're gonna see how it goes, but I'm gonna start recording again once they get the car up and running and they start doing some runs. And I'll let you guys know what's to be expected. Now, I was told that, here, put this in the car. I was told that uh, brand new stock G35s push around 220 to 230 to the wheels. Um, DE rev ups, uh, DE rev up manuals push around 230 to the wheels stock. So I'm aiming for past the 300 mark. I'm aiming for around 310, 320. I'm gonna see what they suggest and recommend. I'm not trying to send it too hard. But 93 pump gas from Shell, as recommended by a buddy of mine. And we'll just see what numbers we get. I'm curious. But even with that much of an increase of like 70, 80 horsepower, that's going to be a massive difference. Here's the G. It's all hooked up. Everything is tied in. And we're just waiting for them to turn on and give her a gander over yonder. Let's see how it goes. I like it. Fifth and sixth gear might be a little bit hard to find. They went through their first couple rips in the car. I don't think they've really passed 4,000 RPMs. My brake calipers are slightly rubbing, but so far sounds good. It looks like we're in fourth gear. Chatter's wild. Sounds like a fucking trumpet. 
looks like we're in fourth gear again. Fourth gear one more time. This is about the third run that he's doing. That time he went up to about four, four to five K. RPMs. Fuck, buddy. <laughs> what do you think? It sounds bro? so crazy. <laughs> that thing is fucking loud. That is so loud. So we're doing. Here, let me step outside, bro. Let's get some air, dude. <clears throat> we're dying to exhaust fumes in there right now. <laughs> I don't think the speakers are gonna do this thing justice. No, they're not gonna do no fucking justice to this thing. So, uh. They've ran a couple times now. It looks like he's slowly moving up. He went from the first pull, he went around 3,000, 3,500. Second pull was around 4K, and now he's around 5K on the third pull. Thing is fucking loud. Transmission chatter is up there right now. I think it might slightly be slipping the clutch because it's new and it's not fully worn in. It might slightly be slipping on him. Uh, but so far, no weird noises. Car sounds good. It's a trumpet and a half. Uh, and from what I'm understanding, <clears throat> we're going to be doing, I believe he's saying five maps. I said I don't really care to have all that much. I would like a performance map. So obviously maximum performance within reason. Obviously I'm not telling him to fucking shit the bed on the car. I'm not forcing the engine on anything. I want something reasonable performance. And then I would like an eco mode. So something that would just at least save me fuel economy. Reasonable performance that's what we're looking for. reasonable performance <laughs> peak performance but no so that's that's what I said he said that the five maps include uh, what performance map is what what people tend to get is either a performance map is the first one second one would be a, a burble or a flame map which I'm not gonna get a flame map because it uh, can damage the internals of the engine it will your back bumper. it'll fuck your shit up so I decided to go with the burble Interrupted. He assured me that uh, <clears throat> he assured me that the uh, the verbal tune does not cause any damage. It just kind of changes the way that the firing sequence kind of works or whatever the fuck. I don't know. Uh, that's their job to know, not my job. But he said that there's no damage that could be caused to the inside of the car. So that I was like, okay, let's do that. So we have performance verbal. Third one would be a low octane. So something in case I can't get a 93 at a pump. I can go down to a 91, so there will be a low octane map, and then from the low octane map, there's a, uh, I believe he said a neutral map or something, which basically allows the car to run on whatever, like if, if I'm stranded or whatever the fuck, it's going to be pretty much the OEM map, and I can put in like dog shit fuel just to kind of get it moving, it would be super restricted, it would preserve the engine more than cause damage and then from there there's an anti-theft and a valet mode which basically doesn't let the car rev past a certain limit <laughs> that, 
That's crazy, bro. <laughs> <laughs> That's fucking crazy. <clears throat> All right, so we just finished up. They're just buttoning up whatever they need to with it, and uh, <clears throat> um, they're getting. This thing's going hard, bro. Did it die? It died? Fuck. <laughs> 